All right, so this is March 27th um, class. We're gonna start now. Um, I see Allison popped on, welcome. Um, excited to have you all here. If you are joining on Facebook or if you're watching the replay, you're welcome to put in the chat what your top health goal concerns are. I'm trying to see if people are popping them in here. We just wanna make sure that we tailor this to what your needs are. Otherwise, we just kind of go general and we'll cover a lot of different things and we'll do that anyway, but I just want to make sure that we cover um, most important things for you. Weight loss, high blood pressure, which is interesting, Joanne. I'm going to share something new that I, I don't know if you saw from Elise. She had been sharing some things that she was doing with her husband, Rick, um, who has been on um, blood pressure medication and had you know been trying different things and stuff. So share that make sure to share that i'm dealing with swollen ankles well that is not fun so you'll dive into that as well um introductions i'm stacy paulson i am a certified health coach but i think more than that i'm a mom of six i think that makes you like you gotta be good at everything this is figured out right <laughs> you're expert at everything everything like we'll oh, figure it out and what is nice is that um like my little ones didn't have like Google, like access to like online stuff. So before that was like, mom, what do you do? Or go to the library or join a class or what does your neighbor do? But now we have so much more access. So like parenting now, I think, well, now there's just like way too much information, but <laughs> we do have a lot more access than we did, right? Okay, so we just have a couple in there. If nobody else wants to share, that's okay. I'm gonna pull up some slides. And I've been using essential oils for about 15, is it 15 years now? My goodness gracious. And one of my, two of my partners in, in crime, Faye and Joel, <laughs> we met in California. Um, Joel had come to a, a booth that I was doing at an LA fitness. And that kind of started our whole awesome relationship with each other. Yeah, I'd say it did. That was a good move on your part. <laughs> Unfortunately, you didn't take anything personally because <laughs> I ignored you for half. <laughs> never, never, never. <laughs> yeah, so maybe you can tell uh, for those who are on or watching the replay or in the Facebook group, your um, experience with essential oils, with doTERRA, with kind of stepping into this realm of holistic living, I guess. I don't know what you want to call this. <laughs> Yeah. Um, well, we had already been living pretty much a holistic lifestyle. Um, that has been our focus for 40 yeah. some years, right? And um, using supplements, herbs, whole food, we were plant-based already. And personally for me, being a nutritionist and in the health field, I was always taught essential oils are only for diffusing and, you know, maybe putting on topically. So when I said I ignored Stacey for a while, I wasn't teasing, I wasn't kidding, because it was like, I'm using herbs already, uh, essential oils, I don't need those, right? And, um, but she was very, um, pleasantly persistent in in just saying you know just come listen these are different and so we finally did come to a workshop and sat there and listened I was still skeptical when the presenter said take it you know put a drop and lick it take it internally when they weren't looking I put it on the bottom of my foot <laughs> <laughs> You guys are crazy, right? But fortunately, Joel's much more open-minded. We took the oils home, tried some samples, started trying them, and oh my God, I was so surprised. Just emotionally, we were going through a lot of stress. It was the big recession, great recession, housing market downturn, um, Joel had basically lost all his income. So lots of stress, sleep with it was an issue. And we started using these and they worked. 
And so from that, it was kind of like, well, what else can they do? And just trying to try them on a lot of different issues that came up, as well as other people like my brother who's on um, and just saying, you know, try them. These, these are different than what you're, you, you know, might've been using. And, and then we realized, wow, you know, this just fits right in to our mission of helping people use natural products and a holistic lifestyle to up level how they how they feel. Right, we already had a business doing that with natural foods and 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 um, natural products all over the country, actually. Yeah. So this was like almost a no brainer once we realized the quality. It was yes. pretty amazing. But and what's amazing is just the stories you know we hear from people the relationships that we developed over the years and so for me i'm always really thankful when i see new faces on here to to be able to hear something that that maybe might be the answer to something going on in your life so thank you all for being here and for those <laughs> listening to the recording, same thing. Thank you for taking the time. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that. And it's so funny because we're like total opposites. Like they came from the more health, like holistic realm. And I came from like traditional American way of living, way of eating, pharmaceuticals, like that. That's where I came from. So I was super skeptical because like, what is an essential oil? <laughs> <laughs> that was my whole take right until i had an experience um where one of my friends just shared an essential oil with me for allergies standing in a hayfield and i just took a couple of drops rode it over the bridge of my nose and within minutes my allergies were gone and so that experience to me spoke louder than anything like i think science or you know diving into data or anything like that i I felt different, a skeptical person trying that and it worked. So I knew it wasn't like a placebo effect, which I was fine with, even if it was, but it worked. So back then, um, I didn't know much about essential oils. And so I want to share with you, uh, our mission isn't just like, oh, let's just talk about a product and start using a product. It really is changing lifestyles because I've seen the difference, the transformation that's occurred in our lives as a family. Like I said, we have six kids. And how I take care of my family now is so much different than how I took care of my family before. And I, I feel more confident in the tools and the resources and the skills that I've gained from having things in my home that are readily accessible to me to be able to use. And I'm always open to go to the traditional route if I need to. And in the past 15 years, there's only been three times that we've gone to the doctor for sick care. And haven't yeah. taken like medications for anything. We're just kind of like checking, like, I just want to be sure. <laughs> right. But we've always just had things right at our fingertips and then making some lifestyle changes have been huge. Let me share my screen and we're going to dive in and just know at any time you are welcome to unmute or to post in the chat, any questions that you may have, anything you want to add. Um, to the conversation, but a lot of people come to doTERRA, come to these workshops because they are looking for a natural way to deal with many different things. It might be digestive pain, blood pressure, um, respiratory issues. Maybe there's been something that they're dealing with and they're taking a prescription or over the counter and it might be working, but they would rather have something else or um, they're dealing with side effects or you just never know, right? A lot of people come to doTERRA because they're looking for natural things to take care of their health. Um, a lot of people come because of pain. Um, I don't know if you've experienced any kind of pain, but I know I have. I used to deal with chronic migraines and that's debilitating, right? And how that not impacts just how I feel, but my relationships, how I show up. Um, the business that I had back at the time was being impacted by it. And so knowing that most people will look to like, maybe over, over the counter or prescription medications for pain, but knowing that we do have alternatives to this. Um, in fact, the FDA estimated that 200,000 Americans are hospitalized every year because of overdoses of just things like your, your Tylenol, your Advil, your ibuprofen, aspirin, 
and they're using it appropriately, yet they're still having some challenges with that. Uh, what we teach and advocate for um, is getting to the root cause. So if you're struggling with a health challenge, if you're able to get to the root cause of it, then you can oftentimes eliminate or really minimize what you're dealing with. Traditional healthcare really masks the, the problem because they often will put a bandaid on it. So if like I went to the doctor several times, even to the ER with migraines and I was told to drink more water, which is great, right? But it didn't solve the problem. It, hel it was helpful, but the next option for them was to give me medication, right? And I didn't want to take that expensive medication, which worked really good. Like it felt good when I took it. Uh, it was super expensive and there were a lot of side effects and I was trying to have an, another child and didn't want to be on that. And so what was I doing? I was drinking a lot of Coke and taking Excedrin. That was my solution. I didn't know any anything else, right? And I was just masking the underlying problem. But once I started figuring out the root cause of it, I was able to address that and eliminate yeah. the microbes, right? And that's really what we want to do. And that's where doTERRA has come in for a lot of people is being able to use essential oils or some other natural products, couple that with lifestyle to be able to get to root causes of those type of concerns. Now, this is doTERRA's wellness pyramid. This is, if nothing else, this take this away because this is life changing if you start implementing these things. So foundationally, nutrition and digestion are the biggest things that will impact your health. Every cell of your body is made up from the things that you consume, whether that's water or food, nutrients, supplements, and they have to be digested and be able to be absorbed in order for that to become a part of your body. So every 90 days, every blood cell that you have is renewed. So the blood cells you have today, if you check in 90 days, completely new. I don't know who's printing in here. Um, sorry if the printer gets loud. And so knowing those blood cells are made up of the food, the supplements, the water, the things that you've been consuming. And so if you are giving your body the things that it needs during that, that three month period, you're going to see differences as you're, as you're doing that, right? Especially if you're coming from a place of I'm not getting enough nutrients, I'm not getting the things that my body needs. And now you start giving your body what it needs. You're going to start seeing the difference. Um, and so just seeing these other levels of the wellness pyramid movement, how exercise and moving your body impacts you metabolism. So that's being able to convert those nutrients that we absorb into energy that our bodies need to function. And then you can see rest, our sleep, managing stress, the toxins that we're exposed to, um, how we take care of ourselves. All of those things matter, but the foundational piece really is this nutrition and digestion. And so if we can address some of those things, a lot of the problems that we're dealing with will go away, or at least we know it's not a nutrient deficiency. It's not a digestive deficiency because I know that's being taken care of. There's something else going on, right? So the number one cause of disease really comes down to these things, nu nutrient deficiencies, inflammation, toxic load, uh, because for the most part, our bodies are miraculous and they can do all these amazing things. But if we start uh, depleting it of the building blocks that it needs, then it's going to have some issues, especially over time. So this is from the EWG, the Environmental Root Working Group, and they did a study and they found that most Americans, 19 years and older, are deficient in vitamin D. Now, did you know that if you're deficient in vitamin D, you're going to start seeing some health issues? You might, one of the first ones is fatigue. So Think about that. If you're dealing with, ah, oh, I'm tired, uh, maybe you have low mood, that whole low energy thing. A lot of people, what they do is they'll go grab some coffee. They'll go grab an energy drink. They'll go draw, you know, grab something with a stimulant in it instead of thinking, ah, oh, I wonder why I'm tired. Um, besides maybe not getting enough sleep, it might be that you're lacking in vitamin D. And how simple that is, is just to be able to have the vitamin D in your body to be able to function. And so you can see the other ones, vitamin E, magnesium, vitamin A, calcium, vitamin C. These are just common things that most people are depleted in. And they impact everything. They impact everything from like your sleep, your emotional health, um, how your body deals with pain and inflammation. So if you're depleted in nutrients, you're going to start seeing other areas of your body um, have problems, right? Um, inflammation, so 
Inflammation is normal. That's something that should happen if, for instance, you get injured. There's inflammation to bring nutrients and oxygen and the, the healing power to that area of your body so that it can heal. What happens with like chronic inflammation is that it just stays inflamed and then you start experiencing other issues. That's where you have the arthritis or bowel disease, skin diseases, um, cancer. Um, you just have all these things that happen because of that. And then toxic load. So we live in the chemical era. <laughs> like there are so many chemicals that we have no idea that we're even exposed to, but it's something that we have to be aware of. So the product safety commission, they tested and found 150 cleaning chemicals that are linked to ADD, asthma, cancer, reproductive problems, respiratory problems, and more. And did you know that if you spray like a chemical cleaner and inhale those chemicals from the cleaner, it only takes 26 seconds to be absorbed into your bloodstream and go to every single organ in your body. So it's just like being aware right? Of, of the things that we're around that we're exposing ourselves to. And there's some things we can't control, but there are a lot of things that we can control. So some of the things that we can control is trying to get the nutrients into our body, right? And so a lot of people will supplement. How many of you take supplements? You can either unmute, say yes, or raise your hand, put in the chat. Um, a lot of people supplement nowadays. The problem or challenge with it is that <clears throat> because it's not regulated like the pharmaceutical industry, which I don't know that we want it to be so heavily regulated, but this was a study that was done by the FDA between 2007 and 2016. So there's a really large period of time that they were doing this and they detected 776 dietary supplements that were produced by 146 different companies that had contaminants in them. So people are trying to take these for their health, yet they're filling their bodies with the toxins. And then the three leading memory supplements, two of them didn't even contain the active ingredient that was listed on the bottle. So that's something we have to be aware of and be concerned about is, okay, if I'm going to supplement, I'm trying to get nutrients. I'm trying to get antioxidants. I'm trying to get omegas. I'm trying to get those things that everyone's saying my body needs. Um, how can we do that in a way that we're feeling confident and we're actually getting that? So that was one of the things that doTERRA um, recognized when they formed um, their company, like, was it 16 ish years ago, 17 years ago. And this was one of the things, and it's their number one product actually. So you think of doTERRA for those who are familiar with doTERRA as an essential oil company, but their number one product is called lifelong vitality. And it's a three pack of supplements and it has all of your vitamins and minerals, your whole food, they're in a whole food form. So your body actually recognizes them, digests it, metabolizes it, utilizes it instead of like most supplements, we actually excrete most of that because they're just not in a form that our bodies can, can utilize has, um, antioxidants in there, has all of your omegas in there it also has seven different essential oils in there. And I just got to point out clove essential oils is one of the highest known antioxidants on the planet. And so those antioxidants help protect us from toxins. It helps to eliminate those toxins so that they don't do damage to our cells. So that's one of the reasons why they put them in there and, and some other things that really help with cellular health. But some of the experiences, and you're welcome, anybody using the Lifelong Vitality, the, anybody that wants to share that's on here, I will put up these, some experiences that other people have had, but we have like thousands and thousands, and thousands of experiences. Faith, were you saying something? I, somebody, I heard someone, but I can't see. Oh, um, I was shaking my head. Oh. <laughs> yes. And I, can, oh. I can read these. I mean, you see migraines, LLV within one month of taking yeah. them, my migraine stop. That was my experience. Energy levels up, my digestion, my mood, my pain levels, my hair and nail growth. And this is really what happens is when your body does start getting those nutrients, you start seeing that difference physically over time, emotionally over time. Um, sometimes it's not just like, oh, I took this and I have so much energy. Sometimes those nutrients are taken and they start working on different areas of your body where it needs it. But you start seeing that for sure over time. But a lot of people quickly start seeing the difference. Yeah. It's funny. 
I saw the difference with energy. I used to need a power nap before I went and taught at night. Um, also, I always thought I was an early morning person. By evening, nighttime, I would just do, you know, tasks, routine things, not really try to focus. And the supplements made a big difference with that. And I also noticed hair, nails, things like that. But I never really thought it affected my mood until one time we were running low on the supplements and I forgot to order them. So I let Joel and my daughter continue taking them and I stopped. It was probably a week and a half, two weeks before we got the new order. And I'll tell you, I noticed such a difference with my mood, irritability, just kind of this down feeling. And I had never really thought they were, you know, having that effect until I stopped. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. And this is, this is another interesting, so this is my friend, Sophie, she lives out there in, uh, well, she used to live out in California. Now she's in Texas, but she had this, she got this rash. It was a, a reaction to, um, an antibiotic that she had taken and could not get rid of it. Yeah. Like doctors had given her prescriptions. She tried treat creams and whatnot. And she, this was all over her body. And so she, her mom introduced us and, I did not know if you know, lifelong vitality, I didn't know if it was going to help. Right. It's, like, I, it's worth trying. And so she started taking a lifelong vitality and within, she said within a day, she started seeing a difference. And then gradually over time, she just saw like it start disappearing where nothing else for months, this was months of having this rash wasn't working. So, I mean, it could be as something as simple as that. And we, uh, you know, that's helpful for our bodies to, to function. And then scientifically wise, as far as clinical trials, the people who were in this trial, they experienced, and so measurable changes in their blood lipids, fasting insulin, cardiovascular markers, triglycerides, cellular information or inflammation. And I really love over here where they saw improvements in mental clarity, energy, motivation, control, happiness, balance, which is huge for most people, right? So that's something to be aware of. And then um, as far as digestive health, because it's not just getting the nutrients in there, it's being able to break them down and absorb those nutrients. Two things to be aware of, and I'm not gonna go too much into this, but just mentally being aware, write it down to, to maybe research a little bit more about this. Um, one thing is getting enough probiotics. And what they are is we, we have trillions of microorganisms that live within us and on us. And it's a relationship that we need without them. We will not survive without us. They don't survive. Um, some of these microorganisms help synthesize, uh, vitamins in our gut. And there's other ones that do other things, but just knowing most of us don't have enough. And so oftentimes we will see a lot of people think just of digestive health with probiotics, prebiotics, but it's more than that. There's these microorganisms that live all over within our body. And so like, if you've taken antibiotics, for sure you're depleted because antibiotics kill, it can't distinguish between good and bad microorganisms. It just kills stuff. Right. And so being able to come in and supplement and bring those back into balance is really helpful not only helpful for digestive health, but it's also good for mental health. There's right. more neurotransmitters in our gut than there are actually in our brain. So this is just something to be mindful of. Um, this PB Restore just came out in September and people's experiences with it have been phenomenal. Like things that I hadn't even thought of. A lot of them were talking about mental health and happiness and mood, which I had never even thought of with a probiotic. I always just thought like, gut health, you know, so I can go to the bathroom better so I can digest better. That's really what I was thinking. Um, but it really can be transformative. So be thinking about that. And then also digestive enzymes. So terazyme is doTERRA's digestive enzyme. And what digestive enzymes do, they break down food, uh, so that we can absorb them. We produce them naturally, but as we age, we produce less and less. We can also get them from food, like whole green leafy vegetables, have them if you haven't cooked them, uh, so we can supplement that way with a whole food diet is, is great. And then if you need extra support, then you can, Terrazyme is something, and this is something that people have been using, uh, 
that I've been using and seeing that like how well I digest, how well I go to the bathroom, um, like foods don't bother me. My husband used to have issues. And so he uses this and it's, it's really been our go-to. Any want to add anything to that? Anyone on? I welcome to share or not. Um, if not, we're going to move into one other problem that we have before we kind of jump into essential oils. And we're going to, we'll talk specifically about any questions you have. Um, so Diabetes is a huge problem in the United States. Anyone guess what's the percentage increase since 1960 in diabetes cases for those who have not been on before? I usually get, you're welcome to put in the chat or unmute. No, I can't say because I know the answer, right? Okay, yeah, you, can, you can't say, but it's a crazy number. It's which, seven, it's almost 700%, 700%. Yeah. That's crazy. Which is crazy. Um, <laughs> and this is a crazy number too. So only 6.8%, not quite 7% of the US population actually has optimal cardiometabolic health. And what that means, so cardiometabolic health is if you're not healthy in that way, you're carrying too much weight. You may have high blood glucose levels, high lipid, blood lipid levels, high blood pressure or blood pressure that's out of range, a history of cardiovascular events. So basically 93% of people have issues with this in some capacity. So whether this is you, your spouse, a child, a parent, a grandparent, sister, brother, friend, right? Like all of us are being impacted by this. So Thinking on that second round, we were talking about nutrition and digestion, metabolism, metabolic health is that next round on there. And so this is something that doTERRA came out with like a year and a half ago, which has been super impactful in that area of helping people um, in different realms. I'm only gonna talk about one of the products in here. There's three different ones. One is an essential oil, it's called MetaPower, which is great for helping to shrink fat cells, helping to, um, curb carb cravings and cravings for foods that maybe we don't really want to have. I mean, we do want to have, but maybe we shouldn't want to have. <laughs> um, so that whole sugar issue, think about that with diabetes. Um, another one is a little capsule. It's called assist and you take it with generally your largest meal. And this helps with those, uh, the blood sugar level spikes, because like when we eat things, then our blood sugar levels will go up. And every time they spike, it causes damage to our cells. So it helps them to stay in a normal range, right? So that's something you can do. But the one that um, mostly focus on is called, um, it's a collagen powder drink. So I don't know how many of you take collagen or have heard of collagen. It's kind of the craze. And a lot of people are taking it for their skin, um, skin health. But collagen is one of the largest molecules in our body that our bodies need. And it makes up like our skin cells. So that's why a lot of people are taking it, but also it is in our joints and in our connective tissue. And so think of if you're experiencing pain, it could be that you're not getting enough collagen to support your body in that way. So you're experiencing joint pain or tendon issues, right? Um, it's obvious when we start seeing our skin aging, but so the, let me just show you some pictures on this. So this sweet lady had been taking this for 60 days and you can see the difference in her skin, right? Um, you can also see she was taking the lifelong vitality and MetaPower and her hair started turning darker. So it's, it's reverse aging. It's helping our bodies get what it needs. And then our bodies are able to repair more like when we were younger, when we could get hurt and we healed so fast, like jump up and, you know, I'm better like the next day and my, my wounds would heal faster. So this is something that's helping with that. It's also helping with weight, um, metabolic health. You can see the difference in her, like the inflammation. Yes, she did lose weight. You can see his hair is, is getting darker. And I love, he was tracking his, um, he had blood work done 
and it showed a 40 point decrease in cholesterol, a 25 point de decrease in LDL and a 57 point decrease in triglycerides. So I think that's pretty crazy. It was three and a half weeks on Metapower. Um, this lady, she was having issues with these spots on her skin. The doctors had biopsied. They just said, it's just because of age. <laughs> There's nothing that they could do about it. And so she started taking the Metapower and within, it was just within three months, those spots totally went away. And she also said that she lost 60 pounds. Her hair's thicker, her nails were growing and her, she, she had lowered her A1C. So pretty crazy what our bodies can do when we start giving it what it needs besides collagen. So there's nine different types of collagen in this powder drink. Most companies, they put in one, maybe three different types, and they're generally very focused on skin, but doTERRA puts in nine different types and they're 12 times more absorbable. So you would have to take 12 of those packets to equal one. If you're, if you're taking a different type of collagen, just because our bodies are able to absorb it better. And then there's something in there is called NMN. And this helps you, I'm just going to say it helps you to have more cellular energy. How's that? I won't go into all the health things on that, but when you take this, you're going to have more cellular energy. You're going to have collagen and there's other things in it, but it's just something that you take once a day. And so thinking about like some of the problems that we have with nutritional deficiencies, with being able to eliminate toxins with digestion and metabolism, those products that I just talked about help support us in that way. So whether you like choose these to take, one of the things that I recommend when you're taking a supplement is that you are confident that they're whole food based, that they're absorbable, and that you trust the company that you're getting them from, that there's a way for you to know transparently that what's in the bottle is in the bottle. And so that's another reason why I appreciate doTERRA is because of all the third-party testing to validate what's in their products. Um, and this is really important as we move into essential oils. So before we jump into essential oils, are there any questions about any of that? And for those who have hopped on since, um, would love for you to put in the chat if there's any specific health goal or concern or need that you're wanting to learn about more of. We just had, Virginia has said, dealing with swollen ankles and Joanne was weight loss, high blood pressure. So we'll talk about those. Um, at any time you can jump in. So something you have to be aware about with the essential oil industry is most of the essential oils on the market are not effective. Most of them are synthetic or adulterated, watered down in some capacity. So this was a study that was done by Roseman University of Health Sciences, Sciences and though Tara did not know that this was going on, but they were buying the, the major brands of essential oils and they were testing them because they wanted to see like, do essential oils out really work? <laughs> like, is this just like one of those, everybody's jumping on the bandwagon kind of thing. And what they found, and they reported this to doTERRA, that doTERRA oils were found to be therapeutically relevant in cell growth and rejuvenation, metabolic health, and healthy inflammatory responses. So it was really, they really help from a cellular level to help your body to function better, right? And then in addition, they said that essential oils from the different competitors had minimal effects. So I'll tell you right now, if you are buying essential oils, again, one of the things I recommend is that you know what's in the bottle, that whatever company you purchase them from, you can get a test of that exact bottle so that you know what's in there and that they didn't do it. There's third party trusted laboratories that are doing that to confirm this is lemon essential oil in here. This is natural. It wasn't made in a laboratory. It's not diluted. It's not, it doesn't have toxins in it or anything else in it other than the essential oils that come right from the plant, right? So whatever you do, they're not going to work unless they're pure and also potent, okay? Um, and that's really why doTERRA's are different. That's why they become the largest essential oil company in the world, a $2.5 billion company, because when people use the oils, they start getting these type of experiences with them that we're going to be talking about um, besides just kind of smelling good, right? A lot of people are buying them because they smell good, but they don't have fillers. Um, they come straight from the plants. We can use them topically. So that would be putting them on. We can use them aromatically. So that's breathing them in. 
and then internally. Most of them, if you read the label of the bottle, it will tell you if you can use it internally. And so it'll, it'll say that if it doesn't say that, then put it on topically or use it aromatically. So a lot of people will use diffusers or just breathe it straight from the bottle. I mean, you can put some in your hands and breathe it in that way. Um, so they're really simple to use. And another thing to be aware of is like safety with that, that you can cause harm if you're using essential oils that are not pure. Um, so this was a little girl that or two got sisters, they were staying over at grandma's house and she put lavender. She had run out of doTERRA lavender, but she had some up from a health food store in her cabinet and had put that on before putting them to bed and it actually caused chemical burns. So it's just something that we need to be aware of um, when we're using essential oils. They can be super potent and powerful, but we want to make sure that they're pure. And then they're also affordable. So this is something, especially now thinking about the economy. I don't know how many of you are being impacted by <laughs> prices going up everywhere. <laughs> I swear like, holy cow, what in the world? You're raising this too. And you're raising this too. And yeah, right. I was just like putting in, anyway, I was just like, this went up $10 and that went up anyway. So I think we're all being impacted by it, but this is a way that you can actually save money. And how it works is because they're so concentrated you use generally between one and three drops would be a dose and so thinking about like when things come up there might be things that you're doing already that you're paying for and we used to go to the doctor for ear infections that was our thing but now we just use lavender and tea tree oil usually within 24 hours costs us less than a do dollar i don't have to go anywhere to take care of that um super inexpensive that way but also as far as compared to other essential oils there was a study just, for example, with Costco peppermint, it was found that the bottle of peppermint only contained about 10% peppermint. The rest was a filler. So you'd actually have to buy 10 bottles of Costco peppermint, which might be cheaper per bottle than doTERRA's pure peppermint, but you'd have to have 10 of them. So then it makes it way more expensive, but you think you're getting a deal, but you're actually not. And that's kind of what's going on in this industry. I don't know if you've noticed on packaging, like, on anything, like half of the packages is actually something and the rest is air. <laughs> like that's kind of what I think of with essential oils is like you're getting, if it is pure, just a small fraction and the rest is a filler. It's not air, it's a filler. So just be thinking about that. And then um, I'm not gonna go in that because of time, but let's jump into some of the common things that people are using essential oils for. Okay, so Let's first address um, high blood pressure and weight. So one of the ways that you can help support yourself with weight. So we talked about the MetaPower um, essential oil, which is actually going to be a giveaway. These are beadlets at the end. So for those who are staying. And so this is something that they found with the essential oil. It's a blend of essential oils that are mixed together that they actually help your cells to release fat and to not grow more. So in one sense, it's helping in that way, but then it also helps reduce some of those cravings. Um, peppermint is another great oil for that. Um, they've, there were studies done that people who are breathing in peppermint actually consume less calories. And so oftentimes it might be a calorie thing. It might be a hormone thing. Um, that would be one that I would kind of work with Faye Joel on to kind of get to the heart of that. Um, immune support ones I've put up on here because we all have an immune system <laughs> and just going through a pandemic. This is something that was super helpful for many people. So on the Terra's lifelong vitality's number one product, the number two product is on guard out of the $2.5 billion of purchases and stuff. <laughs> on guard is number two. It is the protective blend. It helps boost your immune system. It's great for sore throats, colds, flu, cough. You can put it into diffuser and it can help kill pathogens in the air. You can put it on to strengthen your own immune system. You can take it internally to help boost your immune system. But this is one that I would say everyone should have a bottle on hand just in case. Right. Um, and then these other ones for different things, oregano, it's, tea tree, frankincense. Go ahead. Can we talk about um, On Guard's kind of 
a history as far as test being tested. I, I don't know if you might have mentioned it earlier, but I'm just thinking. Go ahead, uh, share. Well, just the idea that that what I recall is that the tests that were done on it showed that it kept pathogens and viruses and bacteria from growing for um, at least 14 days. And uh, that was pretty significant. That's pretty significant if you think about you know, trying to keep your environment clean. Yeah, and so that's on guard, that oil blend is in a lot of different pro products that doTERRA has. So they have like a hand sanitizer, a hand sa sanitizing mist, they have cleaning concentrates, they have laundry detergent. Um, there's some capsules that you can take that have it. There's throat lozenges. They're putting it on, you know, like everywhere to help boost our immune system, to protect us from those threats that are out there. And what's nice is that it's not harmful because sometimes the things that we do are harmful, you know, like if I'm going to be spraying Clorox everywhere and I breathe, breathing in those chemicals, like, yeah, I might be killing stuff, but I'm also doing damage to myself. Right. So thank you for bringing that up. There's multiple ways that we can use uh, the or hand sanitizer, anything that's sanitizing kills everything. And so that's, what's nice switching over to on guard. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because we do have this protective layer on our hands but when you use those regular sanitizers, it kills that protective barrier, right? So you might be protected for a minute while you clean, like kill the bacteria, but then as you go along and you're just going to be getting more, right? And you don't have a protective barrier. Yeah. Exactly. So yeah. it's just some of those things that we're learning through science, through research, what's kind of going on. So these are just little things that we can adjust in our lifestyle that can make a huge difference. And I, if I'm not mistaken, we can make that claim, right? That on guard, you know, kills um, bacteria with the hand with the hand sanitizer. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Let me share my screen again. Um, some other th things that are good to have on hand. Um, these other five oils are just kind of my go-to. The ones from the page. Oh, I didn't mention on frankincense. So frankincense. I love this oil. Um, I just did a YouTube video on it. So I was doing a lot of research and one of the research studies showed that frankincense helped to trigger our killer T cells in our immune system. So that's like the, the cells that will go out and attack foreign invaders. Right. And so by using frankincense helps boost your own immune system. So where on guard might be t attacking threats, you know, like from that perspective, Frankincense is actually helping to boost your own immune system to do what it needs to do to fight off those threats that we're exposed to. So it's also great for wrinkles. It's great for cellular health. Um, it's really good for your mood. So if you experience those low moods, um, that's one that you can use. As far as in your medicine cabinet, just kind of having on hand, if ever you have respiratory issues, breathe can help clear up your your nose, your sinuses can help with snoring, asthma, allergies. Digest Zen is an oil that's great for digestive support. Um, you can put it in water. There's some capsules you can take. You can rub it right on your belly, which I always thought was so crazy. My husband would get like digestive things and he would take a couple drops and just rub it on his stomach. I'm like, how does that work? <laughs> but he swears like it just, just takes away any kind of gas bloating it works. on my babies. So they would just go to the bathroom. Yeah. Um, Peppermint's great for energy focus, hot flashes, fevers, headaches. Lemon is a great detoxer. This is one that is great. Any of the citrus oils are great in your water. They help to gently detox our bodies. Um, lavender is very calming. So if it's something like with stress or sleep or skin irritations, you can put it on. These are all just great for multiple things. And seasonal threats oh allergies. coming up yes are coming up lavender, had lavender, peppermint the three together yeah so these three right here um are great if you have allergies so you can diffuse them you can put they don't taste that good but you can put some in water and drink it but there are some capsules they're called tri -ease. capsules that you can buy and just take those it clears things up and then you don't have i used to have tons of allergies and would take medication and they would kind of over dry you and you just felt off, but your nose wasn't running. Your eyes weren't like watering, but you just felt off. This isn't like that. It just takes it away and you feel 
normal. So yeah. Uh, Our five-year-old grandson has terrible allergies. And one of them is dogs, some cats. So when he comes over, as much as we clean, he just always has runny nose, sniffling, coughing, all put in the diffuser, frankincense, peppermint, lemon, and lavender, clears them up. It's amazing. So nice, so easy, so mm -hmm. easy. Yep. And then pain, um, deep blue, there is an oil, but uh, most people will use this rub. It's like a lotion. You just put it on. I think of like icy hot Bengay, but it's natural, works really, really well. Um, there is a stick, so you don't have to like put it on your hands. You just kind of rub it on. And this stick has the deep blue oil, which is great for all of those awesome things, but also has copaiba in there, which is a, another great anti-inflammatory um, pain reliever. Awesome. Awesome stuff. So those are just some of the things like maybe write down if you're dealing with anything kind of have on hand. Mood support. These oils are great. Write them down, take a screenshot, whatever. Adaptive balance, serenity are kind of the go-tos. If you have like anxiety, anxious feelings, that type of mental fatigue, forward thinking, you know, like, ah, oh, what could happen? Ah. Um, adaptive is your, your friend. Balance is more grounding. So you can diffuse that, put that on. It helps um, with any kind of grief, trauma. And then serenity is your kind of up level, I think from lavender, especially if it's trying to go to sleep. Um, this is one that you can diffuse. Works really, really well. Um, now I did want to mention because somebody, the high blood pressure. So there is a new oil out. It's called Shinrin Yoku, which is Japanese forest bathing. Um, kind of a weird name, but it's, it's, it's kind of the nature oil. Um, so this has been studied for people who have high blood pressure. That's not what it was made for, but it, it's kind of like the relaxing, get out in nature, go for a walk, be in, you know, in the woods, that kind of thing. And it really helps to relieve stress when you're just out there doing that. But this oil is something that you can use anytime, even when you can't get out for most of us, we spend most of our time indoors we're not out in nature. Some of us who live in like Utah, Colorado, like we don't even want to get outside because we like go freeze. Um, but it's healthy for us to be outside, to have that experience. But this oil, Shinrin Yoku, I don't have it with me just by breathing it in people who have been doing it throughout the night. So they'll put it in their diffuser at night. It's lowering their blood pressure. So one of our friends, Elise, who's not on, she had sent a text about this because her husband had been struggling with high blood pressure. He's been on two medications and still had his numbers were like his low average numbers were in the one forties, um, one forty eight over 98. And so she was started tracking as he was using this oil and they, it just started gradually going down. And she said, we started tracking Rick's blood pressure when we started diffusing Shinrin Ryoku. After I heard the results, the Dr. Rick shared it leadership. He's been on blood pressure meds for years and the blood pressure you see at the beginning of March has been his norm. So he's never been able to get it down even with the medications and just by diffusing that. So that'd be something Joanne to maybe think about us adding to the, the mix of things. Um, the swollen ankles mentioned there. Um, that would probably take some more questioning. I would probably like talk with Faye or who Virginia. Yeah. Um, because you want to kind of figure that out deeper because there's things that you could put on that might be helpful, but then there's also um, some lifestyle things that might help with swollen ankles. I, I wish that was a quick fix because I've dealt with that. <laughs> um, what, what were some of the things you found helpful? The thing that I found most helpful was the MetaPower collagen. I found that when I was taking that consistently, like I had less episodes of that, even with traveling. So usually when I'm in like for the past several months, I've been traveling a lot and I usually just, my legs will swell up and it was very minimal. So that might be something. Um, so I don't know if that's like with cellular integrity of like with, oh, and also electrolytes, right? So I started putting some salt 
mineral salts in my water, but now doTERRA has the MetaPower Recharge, which is a really good balance of electrolytes because we need water. So make sure you're hydrating, but then you also need the electrolytes because that's what will help with the bot the water getting into the cells and moving out of the cells and just that passing back and forth. And so those are just some maybe things to be thinking about your movement, your amount of hydration, MetaPower, the advantage, the collagen drink, getting enough electrolytes. That would probably be where I would start um, with that. Uh, let's see, Lisa, full digestive tract issues. So we talked a little bit about those. I don't, you might be looking into like lifelong vitality, the PB assist and Terrazyme for sure. Um, Digestin is one that you can use like topically. Woo, go blues. <laughs> um, heart health, menopause. Ooh, yay, fun. Um, so cardiovascular health, that kind of goes along with the lifelong vitality and the meta power we talked about. Um, menopause, hormone, balancing things. Again, foundational, lifelong vitality. The meta power is amazing. Um, a really important thing with menopause is also managing the amount of sleep that you get, um, the amount of stress that you deal with. So it could be simple as like the serenity helping with sleep or balance. It's really grounding. Or if you deal with, you know, anxious feelings, adaptive is a great one. Um, and all of those play into weight. So I generally don't like to focus on weight. I like to focus on the, the wellness pyramid, right? Those different aspects of the wellness pyramid. Do I have the pieces in place? Do I have the habits in place that will help me to get there, right? And not focus on that end goal. It's like one step in front of the other. Am I doing this? And so if there are certain things as far as getting enough nutrients, getting your digestion in, in place, your metabolism, you're moving, you're getting enough rest, you're reducing toxins, like all of those things. Um, those come before like thinking, Oh, I need to be on medication. Or I need to do this. Or I need to do that. Like get those things in place and then kind of evaluate. I hope that's helpful. Anything to add with that, Bay Joel or anyone else? Oh, just emphasizing meta power, um, with the importance of that cellular foundational health for, for all those issues. And what I found even when I had all the pieces in place, for some reason, maybe age kind of stubborn weight. And when I added the meta power to it, the weight started normalizing i guess this way you know losing losing the weight and the inches so um if it was a you know transformational it was game changer yeah yeah okay so we're going to be kind of wrapping up i don't know like for those of you who have um doTERRA is kind of like costco in the sense of um well better than costco for sure but if you go to their site, doTERRA.com, you would have to pay retail price. Some of you who are on are wholesale customers. And what that means is they get to go shop and they get 25% off. And you can get a free wholesale account with doTERRA. There's no obligation to like purchase so much or so often, like you can go shop whenever you want, but you get access to 25% discount. But you need to go through whoever invited you to this. So if it was Faye, you need to go through her. She will have a discounted VIP link that she can give you so that when you click on that, it will give you that discount for free. And then you have that access to that for a full year of 25% off, which is really nice. And you can shop and, and purchase whatever you want as small, big, whatever, as often as you want. So I just want you to be aware of that. And also there is a promo um, code that she can give you to give you access to um, some free oils. There's like a lavender touch that you can get. There's a citrus bliss, which smells heavenly. Um, you can get a free diffuser. There's just some perks. So just make sure that you work through her, or if you're watching the replay, it's somebody else, just make sure you work with them and get that promo code so that you can get those, those discounts. Um, and then also I want to show you this picture before we jump off it or before we do the giveaway. Dun, dun, dun. share my screen. Where did it go? My zoom things. There we go. 
Okay, so I absolutely love this. How many of you have one of these? If you don't have one of these keychains, you need one of these keychains. This is kind of like my emergency kit, is my everything, is my travel kit, is my I have it all in my thing, um, little kit. So this is putting oils into a smaller vials, but it just makes it really handy to be able to go anywhere. So somebody has digestive issues, somebody's feeling nauseous, somebody's getting a headache, maybe you have some cramps, maybe you fell and cut something. <laughs> like it doesn't matter. Like it's in here. Um, if you want to get one of these for free. And you also, maybe during this, you were thinking of people who might benefit. We love having hosts and you can do it just like this, three to five people gather to, in Zoom or if you're local that you can gather together, um, that you can get one of these for free just by hosting a class like this, a workshop to be able to teach your friends and family um, how to use these. We can send even samples to people so they can be like smelling the peppermint and doing this during the class. Just know that that's available. And this is how this information gets shared. Most of us, it's from friends, family, somebody that we met that was willing to kind of say, hey, are you open to learning about these things? So just know that that's available to you. And now we're going to be doing a giveaway. I'm going to be giving away these MetaPower beadlets. So this these are awesome. You just pop one in your mouth. It can help with any food cravings. It helps refresh your breath. It helps with those stubborn fat cells. Um, let me get the link. So what you're going to do, I'm going to put a link to a survey. And this just kind of gives us feedback. Best know how to follow up with you or what you liked most about the class. I put it in the chat. And so hopefully you can just click on that. If you're on your phone, you might have to tap and then go to the chat and then click on that link that I just put in there and then fill out the answers to the survey. That will enter you into the giveaway that we're going to do um, for the MetaPower beadlets. And everyone on is welcome to- Everyone on, even if you've been on before, if you've entered yeah. something before, everyone is welcome to enter okay. okay and while we are waiting for you to fill that out um sometimes it's hard to fill it out and have someone talking or so i'm gonna let you all fill that out wow I guess uh, silence is is probably golden, but I gotta say something. Okay, well, I'm gonna stop the I'll stop the live stream and I'll stop the recording.